Hey everyone, today for Weekend Warriors Virtue, we got Sun here. Yeah, the female Rue. Uh, let's see, up here, interesting thing, there's a little price tag. You can see it's marked down to $1.99. I guess back in the day they were trying to get rid of these, which is weird, because actually she's like a lot of people's favorite now. Anyway, there's a little picture of her up there, right out of the movie. And uh, let's see, take a look at the back little blurb here. We got Virtue of Loyalty, Security of Earth. Sun embodies the security of Earth. She is a resourceful fighter. She absorbs blows from her opponents and redirects the force back against themselves. Sun arms herself with a sword of stone, which she can slam into an enemy like an avalanche. Soon is the first female warrior, a tomboy from an old and distinguished family. She left her aristocratic life to train with Master Chung. She uses the knowledge of plants and minerals found beneath the ground to heal and nurture the inhabitants of Tao. Her faith and selfless dedication is the bond that holds the five warriors of virtue together. Okay, sounds about right. Let's uh, pop her out of the box here. This one's one of the ones that came in a bit of a nicer box, so... Yeah. Okay. okay, pop right out of there. And there she is in the plastic. Pop uh, that off there. And uh, there she is. Yeah. Let's see, she's got a little sword here. Let's see if I can uh, slide right out. Okay, there's the sword there. Oh, I love the detail on this. This looks nice. Oh, that is cool. I like that. And then there we got the figure. Let's see. I want to be really careful because I haven't had good luck with the ruse so far. Like, these always have... Okay, she has some really, really stiff joints here. Okay, that leg's moving. This one's moving. It's kind of weird. It's like stuck out a little bit. Yeah. Tail. Oh, the tail moves right away. That's nice. So, no problems with the tail. So now, let's see. Head moves. No problem there. Arm feels a little weird. Okay, now it's feeling a little better. And the other one. Okay, everything works on Sun here. Nothing feels loose or uncomfortable, like it's gonna snap off and break. So, let's take a look at the detail. She's got a lot of really nice detail of, like, all the characters. Let me move my light up a little bit here. Uh, it's a little too dark now. Eh, whatever. Uh, let's see. Uh, I don't know how to get the light to get just right here. Maybe if I turn this a little bit? Hmm. Okay, I guess that's the best the light's gonna, gonna be like. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know what's, what's up with the light today. Anyway, got that nice little flower crown there. That's really cool. That's a neat little detail. One of the really cool things, she has this little, like, uh, satchel thing wrapped around her. You can see it's, uh, let's see. I'm not really sure what that is in there. Flowers or something? Let's see. On the front, she's got, like, all these little bands. Kind of reminds me of, like, uh, some Native American type of dress with little feathers and beads at the bottom there. Okay, I just heard something make noise over there or whatever. Anyway, a lot of detail on her. I think more than any other characters, she has a lot of little details. Let's see, let's try to put the little sword in her. Oh, it fits right in her hand. That is so cool. You know, how often do you see the female character of something with a sword? I think that's kind of rare, because, like, I'm a big Power Ranger collector, and it's not often that, like... When everybody has, like, a different kind of weapon, the female character is the one who gets the sword. So that's a cool little unique thing. I really like the sword, the detail on the sword, too. You can see, like, how it was made. With, like, there's little... There's, like, a pole, then there's little ropes through it to, like, keep, I don't know, sturdy, whatever the outside of it, the material is. That's a neat little detail. Let's see. Oh, and you can see, like, little ropes around the ends of, uh... Her sleeves there, and the ends of the pant legs there. You can see the kangaroo feet there. And there's the tail. 
Man, she's got a lot of... The detail is definitely the nicest on Sun. Oh, and the hand is nice, too. Look at that. If you can make it out through the bad lighting. Let's see. So, yeah, this is a really nice one. I really like this figure. The face is, uh, is really good. Some people think these guys look kind of creepy with the makeup, but I, I don't know. I, I always thought it looked pretty cool. So, yeah, I guess that's it for this one. Hope you enjoyed this. See ya.